And hello to you from the sunny south coast of England. We're at the Amex Stadium and the weather has most certainly cooperated. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Brighton versus Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, on paper, it's down as a 4 5 1, but for me, it's more likely to be a split midfield with three supports in the front man and two sitting that little bit deeper as defensive cover. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Well, they're matching up here, so midfield domination will be key to winning this game. If they can manage that, it will then allow their fullbacks to join their attacking play. Thank you, the Amex Stadium. Enjoy the game. And so the match is underway. And great work to confuse the defender. Well, danger averted thanks to his teammates. Oh, that's a fine pass. Crossing into the middle. And an effective clearance. Bruno Fernandes has it. Nice looking move. In it goes. That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, it's a big moment for Eric Ten Hag. He now just needs to get his team refocused and concentrate on the game. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Jakub Moda. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Diogo Dallo. Potentially freedom for United on the flank. Must score! Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. That was miles off target. United regaining possession here. Gross. United being afforded too much space. The cutback. Casemiro. High quality defending. Distribution. Well back. It could be up for grabs. 
And a time for composure on the ball. Well, that was good play by Brighton. They just need that end product now. It's a great save by the goalkeeper, though. And a poor attempt at a challenge, and on he goes. Must be! And a goal here for Manchester United. They are the big favourites now. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, but there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plomb. It's a great goal. Two nil here, and the ball is moving again. Reception. Please, can you go to reception if you've lost your keys? Well back. Well, good run and good ball control. Good defending. Now can they counter clinically? Bruno Fernandes, and putting his body on the line. Dallo. Oh, could be an opportunity here. Gets in the way once more. And the defensive intervention there. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Well, he's been ruled offside. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Adam Webster. Well, we're almost at the halfway stage and they're not making home advantage work for them one little bit here. Stuart, your assessment? Well, they can certainly play better than this. It's been a disappointing first half display from them. But if they can just play with more urgency and energy in the second half, they can get back into this. They definitely have the quality. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. Great ball over the top. Could be a chance. He's gone and found the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. Well, as you can see here, Fernandez gets beyond the challenge of the defender and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. And so the first half has come to an end here at the Amex Stadium. Not to be too blunt about it, Stuart, but this has been a struggle for him up front. Yeah, he's just not found his form today. He doesn't look quite right. Unless he can impose himself on this game and start threatening the keeper, they're going to lose this one. So back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. Promising sequence. And that is how to beat your opponent. Good defending in the end, and danger averted for now. Well, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. Jakub Moda. 
Pascal Gross. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. And Welbeck! Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then just look at this finish, Derek. He does so well to read the bounce. Often you can send these into row Z, but he makes the perfect contact. Stunning goal, really. So back underway at 3-1. Casemiro. Anthony. Now Casemiro. Casemiro. Manuel Ugarte. Rasmus Hoilund. A glorious chance. A goal! Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. So the action underway once more, and it's beginning to look as though it's a case of how many for United. Welbeck. Moda. United have it once again. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Might work out. Oh, that is an outrageously good stop. Well, great reflexes from the keeper. He did brilliantly there. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. And over it comes. No one able to do any damage with it. Well, good effect of pressure. Good-looking ball. Ugarte. Bruno Fernandes has it. The size to shoot. Just couldn't get it through. For Here's a change for Manchester United. Number 20, Diogo Dallo. Coming onto the pitch. Number 29, Aaron Wan Bissaka. Delivering it. Struggling to get it away. Anthony Casimiro and intercepts again Lalana oh big chance and this time it's in fabulous goal and just look at the celebrations Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Just 15 minutes remaining. Bruno Fernandes has it. He's in here. Oh, fine stop. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. short corner here Fernandes great defending 
Well, it's a wild attempt. He needed something better. Offside, however. Well, you're right. He didn't know it was going to be offside, and that was a shocking miss. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. Mazraoui. delivery towards the back post splendid defending short corner taken makes his way in field is it going to be and he's kept it out fully stretched somehow reaching it now how about the short corner and crossed in the direction of the back post. There it is! Victory more or less guaranteed now. Well, here's the replay, and they work it well just to change the angle on the cross, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Well, no wonder Eric Ten Hag's delighted. They're bossing the game now. Goal for Manchester United. Number 32, Casemiro. Pedro. Here's Gross. Well back. And the cross smuggled away. Nusser Mazraoui. Now De Ligt. Oh, he's lost possession. Cross could be useful. The pressure is on. Can he clear it away? That'll be a United throw. In it goes! And the second time of asking, and the keeper feels hung out to dry. Well, here we can see it again. Normally I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. And there goes the final whistle, not to be for Brighton in terms of the result. What did you make of it? You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out. But it just seems that this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.